You won't believe that after this, you're going to design your home without any limitations and with confidence. Hi, welcome to Kunda Home, a place where we go to discuss all the tips and tricks to elevate your home. I'm Doreen, your host, and today we're going to be talking about how to design a luxury modern home. The first thing that uh, you would think about is what's interior design. Interior design is the research, planning, and design or creation of a beautiful bespoke space. Transforming your space, it has so many elements that goes in, what you can do, what you can't do. Could really hire an expert to do that for you but some of the tricks that I'm gonna share with you today can help you transform your own space from a boring space into a modern luxury home so let's get started on the tips of designing a luxury modern home point number one it's gonna be planning and aesthetics and when I talk about planning and aesthetics there is so much that goes on under this for instance when you're planning you already know the design style that you want a luxury modern interior this is a design that is associated with high standards of living yet it's very sophisticated and also very simple in character under planning a modern luxury interior it shares the same view globally like the clean lines focusing on functionality but then there are some subtle elements that are different if I'm talking about the modern luxury interior of the Bauhaus in Germany it's gonna be different compared to the African luxury modern home. While you plan your space, you're going to identify these elements so that you can incorporate them into your space or you check those elements that you want to identify with. That brings me to aesthetics. What feeling do you want? Aesthetics is the feel of your space or the look of your space. It's always advisable to do a mood board so that you can really bring a vision of how you really want your space to look like. You've gotten to plan while you creating a vision of how you really want your whole space to look like. Creating a mood board would really help you to bring out that vision, that look that you're looking for. And if it doesn't really make sense, then you change it. A mood board helps you to really communicate your ideas. The secret to designing a luxury modern home would be planning and aesthetics. Don't skip this step. It's the very backbone of your whole design. Uh, next thing, car operate. Modern luxury interiors make use of the modern colors and especially the classics which is black, white, pink, cream, metal. At least for the base color it has to be a classic one and uh, I know for African interiors most people are drawn into color but for a luxury home you're going to really stay away from contrasting colors. While purple and teal are luxurious colors I would always reserve them for the exterior of a house rather than the inside. It would really look amazing on the exterior of a house, but could you imagine your living room in purple? I mean, it doesn't really bring out that element of luxury. Honestly, stay away from contrasting colors if you want a luxury home interior. So let's say you've gotten your space, gotten everything in it, and you're wondering how you upgrade your space or give it a pump to make it look luxurious is by molding and paneling. We can all agree that when you are those panels into our space there is transformation and I think I shared some parts there was some room we did some paneling and it was like magical so if you're someone really that wants to transform your space or you want to add elements of a luxury feel or look please try to do molding and paneling it would really do magic to your space Lux lighting lighting can either make a space or break a space if you want to really upgrade your space you want that luxurious look you're going to have different lighting for different purposes in your space and I've been to places where mostly Airbnb like they have just one overhead lighting so bright it's like hospital lights please don't do that to your space you want a luxury look have different lighting for different purposes so that it can let me say you want to clean at night or let me say you want to read a book let me say you want to watch a movie have different lights for different purposes so that 
that you can really create that ambience if you're really designing or you want to upgrade your space adding different lighting that could serve different purposes either for emphasis on design details or you could use the lighting just for cousins the carvings you choose when you're designing your space they should be warm not something so bright that is really branding now talking about that my next point would be focal points focal points these are places which draws anyone's attention once they enter your space can have many focal points so add different focal points so that when a person is just enter your space they can't have their eyes drawn to this specific element it's important to add focal points in any design window treatments for a luxury home interior don't use rack out heavy curtains mostly it's actually advisable to go for wrong curtains especially when it's the living room space instead of using heavy breakout curtains use sheer and if you have a sun coming in into your space choose outside brands like you could pull up pull down when it's shining in modern luxurious homes study fabrics like cotton linen silk laser plus velvet and satin are commonly used so to upgrade your home you're going to go for these other fabrics which really portray class and uh, luxurious uh, for instance when you look at this jar this is like 10 years old this is velvet but when you look at it actually eye to eye the camera doesn't do justice still looks so good and ugunda him we talk so much about the mud growth a luxury piece uh which is made out of 100 percent pure cotton and handmade it's one way you could add some luxury into your space of course there's also choosing the subtle patterns or geometric shapes to really add that element of modernity into a space one way you can really transform a space throw on pillows you don't have really to go and break into a bank you can start with simple elements around your home like throw on pillows like the throw on in these amazing fabrics instead of going to buy like a 10,000 euros so far on top of fabrics a luxury modern home utilizes natural elements such as stone wood even a concrete to give off a more bolder more elegant and unique role natural stones such as granite and marble are capable of elevating any interior your space so if you can really afford it go for natural elements always choose quality over quantity and of course don't forget the wooden pieces wooden pieces are ideal timeless pieces that you can really incorporate into your home there is no single day wood is gonna go out of train just the same as the traditional elements of design like this mud cross can never go out of fashion it's timeless like something like this this is timeless but this could be used on your coffee table for your remote or anything we don't have it on our website but we got the pillows on the website we got the pillows and we got so many options which are cheaper so yeah one of the ways you can really elevate your home is adding natural elements into your space balance balance creates stability in any interior design style the colors the textures and shapes this is having equal amount of elements on each side a typical hotel bedroom for instance have a side bed table and then this other side you also have a side bed table of the same height same style and then you have a lamp and then you have a lamp lack of balance makes a design less cohesive and you don't want that for a modern luxurious look so to create a luxurious modern look you've got to keep balance at the back of your mind as you design your spaces you want a luxury home design look don't forget to measure for instance like one of the things that actually we always forget as humans is really going to design our spaces without measuring the area or the spaces we want to design if you don't measure your space you're going to really create um, a lack of balance which we just talked about there will be lack of cohesiveness but when you measure your space you're going to bring in elements which are proportional to the space you measure so whether it's a coffee table whether it's a sofa please make sure that you have the measurements right 
so that you can really know how to design your space in a cohesive way to create that cohesiveness into your space. So in other words, don't just buy stuff without measuring it. That's one of the design tips that you shouldn't forget. Honestly, shiny, trendy items. Stay away from such items which are trendy. And uh, if you want a luxury home look, you're going to stay away from shiny, shiny, shiny things. Uh, like we discussed before, we said a luxury home, it utilizes natural elements. Don't go back and then mix it up with the shiny, shiny bring, bring. No, it doesn't work. Natural elements, natural home decor, whether they are small pieces, it doesn't matter. Just stay away from the trendy, shiny items. And sometimes uh, these items are really like nice, but then they are trendy and also they are shining. It would just throw off your design, in other words, to stay away from them. Talking of that, next point would be adding live brands. I got brands which are not natural, I think one, but to add that modern element, the modern luxurious design day, one of the elements is adding in something living or fresh brands to bring in that freshness. Uh, I don't know, maybe it's what we've gone through over the past years. So one of the things that you can really do to design or upgrade your home to a modern luxurious home is adding in live brands, not artificial ones. I've seen some places with artificial. When it's artificial, um, well, maybe you could add one, but not many of them, and not the kind that is obvious, you know? Another point would be adding art. And of course, here we talk mostly about African interiors, but one of the things that you can really do to upgrade your home is adding meaningful art into your space. An art that can tell a story, an art that can really tell your visitors who you are, add art that can speak of volumes without saying anything. So, so one of the ways you can really change your space or you can really add that luxurious moment is, and of course also it would be wise if you're someone that really likes to change your art all the time, it would be wise to go for shelves, like you shelf so that you can add your art and then you can interchange it all the time. But for some of us that are okay, not changing your art all the time, like you could look at the same art for 10 years or more years, it's very okay if you went for this, like it's okay if you went big. Oh, and lastly, if you're still here, by the way, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up so that you can be able to enjoy more content. And that said, let's talk about unity. Unity is the harmony produced by all other elements of the room and how the elements in the room create a relationship as organically as possible. A lack of unity can make a design so disorganized and cluttered. So as you're designing your whole space with all these tips, remember also that there is balance, there is unity, really unify all the elements of your space so that you don't look disorganized, it doesn't look cluttered. Oh, also another point actually I forgot, being minimal. Being minimal is also a characteristic of a modern luxurious look. Keep it minimal and don't go overboard with things. Uh, going overboard is for boho. If you haven't watched that video, go check it out, how to design a boho lifestyle. At least it's a style that is free. It gives you freedom to do whatever you want. But if you want a luxurious home look, you're going to keep all these tips that I have given you in the last few minutes. With those points, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye for now.